Estonian, Croatian. Hmm. Romanian, makes sense. Istanbul. Discipline and punishment. Jesus, JC. Like reading. Supposed to call. You sent directions. I didn't think. That's your problem, Davy. You don't think. Let's not start like this, yeah? Flipping it. Not much to do around here, is it? That's a good book, that. Don't really read much. You just start asking yourself what's important, baby. Yeah, did that in school. Didn't really work out. Yeah, well that's why you're here. You screwed up. I'm gonna change all that and give you a chance. What, selling drugs? Dream on me. No, it's no dream. I make about 20,000 pounds a month, sometimes double that. <laughs> I thought selling drugs is like a hobby or something. Nah, it's more of a sideline now, bonus. I'm onto something much bigger and better. Wait, <laughs> is this something to do with what's behind door number three? You heard something. Look, what you do for fun isn't my business. But are you saying this is your business? David, this is what I do. And exactly what do you do? What are you getting me into? I'll show you. What it's all about? This beautiful little creature from Moldova. She's one of thousands we brought to the country. We never met. Put this on. We got company. Okay, it's just too tough. We got a couple of minutes, so. Mate, how do you bring the girls into the country? You don't need to know that. Well, why did you bring them here? Lots of firms keep girls in the city. It's easier to move around out here. Man, the girl next door thing just took a whole new meaning. But you've only got one girl here. Right now, this one's sick. Next delivery is in three days. So how do you make 20000 a month? I mean, do you get commission or what? God, you're naive. No, we own them. They're a commodity. 20 girls a month. We get the girls in Moldova. And then depending on their attributes, we sell them for about five grand a piece and split the profit. What? You're kidnapping innocent girls? Selling them to brothels? My own brother's a slave trader. Yeah, and you're in it too, whether you like it or not. You're going straight to hell, mate. <sighs> yeah, 
I've already been there. You know, they don't teach you to kill a guy, ten guys. They don't teach you how to live with it. So don't judge me. Anyway, my training makes money for me now. Besides, most of the girls are better off here than where they came from. Most of them would do anything to get into the UK. What, and you're just gonna say, hey, do you wanna be a snag in London? Oh, of course not. They expect jobs as models, cleaners, working in agencies, stuff like that. And they're happy. They get used to it. Easy, mate. I'm just trying to understand, yeah? The Albanians process them. By the time they're finished, nobody tries to escape. If anyone's going to hell, it's them. Expecting trouble, are we? I don't trust anyone, little brother. Not even you. What do the Albanians do to him? A lot of psychological stuff. Some physical stuff. These guys are generations of horse trainers. They break them down, break their spirits. The key is rapio dominatus. And what the heck is that? Yeah. That's something perfected by the Romans. Rapid domination. We call it shock and awe. So, get used to your new line of work, little brother. Stay here and keep your mouth shut. I'm going to see what Dutov's got for us. I wasn't expecting you for another three days. Special delivery. Yeah, well, I don't like surprises. Surrogate thinks you'll like this one. White silk, pure as snow. Pure? You sure? Look, Sergei has some guys grooming kids. Much cheaper than bringing from Yola. Shit, he could have asked me first. All right, get her in. Tell Sergei we're going to talk about this. Stay. Well, it looks like Dutov bought us a little white Barbie. Don't call me that! Anyway, if you're their boss, that ugly pig hit me! Look at my in the cage with the other one. Okay. Now! Okay. When do they get to eat? They don't. At least not today. Why not? It's part of the process. You'll find out. Mate, I didn't sign up for starving and torturing people, yeah? You didn't sign up for anything, Davey. That's your fault. That's why you're here. You screwed up. So, you need to deal with it. All right. Well, don't remind me. It's not like things could get any worse. She's going to drive us crazy.
not taking any crap from you. Yes. Do you hear? Yes, I just haven't eaten, please. I'm sorry. I'm thirsty. Give her what's left. But I thought you said... Just do it. Fine, sit down. Can I have some water? Yeah, give her some water. Thank you. You're welcome, I think. What about the other one? Did I ask you? No. Okay then. Hey, that's not fair. She should eat even if she is a slut. She thinks you're a slut. Slutcher. You gonna let her get away with that? JC. So sorry. I didn't mean for them to hurt you. I've survived longer than most girls. So, you do speak English? A little. Oh, I can't believe this is happening. I remember feeling that way. Now, I don't feel anything. You mean you were kidnapped? Like me? You think I'd choose this? Two years in hell. I'm so sorry I called you a slut. I didn't know. I, I thought... A prostitute. Problem. <laughs> Nobody knows. Hundreds of girls like me. And they force you to... Every night. Many. Many times. Sometimes I... I could hardly walk. But I'm... Oh, God. I just want a job. I was model in Moldova, but little money. I saw an advert for models in Germany. I was so excited. But they tricked me. That's when it all started. What's wrong? I've never... They must not find out. They already know. <laughs> what are you doing anyway? This is little Barbie's auction page. Thank you. 